Most people think that divorce settlements are 50-50, but they're not. The starting point is 50-50, and that pendulum swings by looking at a number of criteria. Every settlement is unique, based on needs, children, the length of the marriage, contributions, ages, and income capacity. This may mean looking at bank statements, house valuations, pension statements, management accounts, and tax returns. All of this has to be completed by both parties. The worst thing that anyone can do at this stage is not to disclose bank accounts or capital. This could lead to huge delays in gaining assessment. Once there's been an exchange of disclosure, I always find it helpful to ask what you want, what you need, and what you can live with. It's much better to be open and transparent about what you have. Settling matters quickly and amicably can also have a positive effect in terms of any parenting relationship where there are young children. Saving costs could also mean the difference between a postcode and a bedroom. The way you present your financial position is crucial in helping you swing the pendulum in your favour.